Leave it 851, turn right heading 180. 014 Papa, turn right 245, report localizer established. Airlines are quietly preparing for the future of their operations within the aviation industry. Today's focus centers around Qantas, who are not immune to the discussion surrounding fleet renewal. Before the pandemic, the airline was actively looking at ways to renew its fleet with more efficient aircraft of the latest generation. From a regional standpoint to its narrow body operations within the country and of course through to the likes of New Zealand. Thanks to a report by Reuters, Qantas is now going once again about this, reaching out to various aircraft manufacturers regarding aircraft that would power the airline for the next decades. Before I go and look at what the options are involving the plane, we really need to take a look at their current fleet of aircraft to determine just what needs replacing in the future. The airline has currently a very diverse fleet and, at its core, a very simple fleet of aircraft that it utilises for its operations day to day. The airline operates the 737s for its domestic operations, while also seeing some of the A330s featuring on the network. Namely, they can be seen on services across through Perth from eastern cities of that of Sydney and Melbourne, also Brisbane. Often having the A330 flying on these said routes before the pandemic and of course the border shutdowns. For its long haul operations, the airline utilises the Airbus A380 alongside the Boeing 787 with the A330 300s being seen in and around Asia. However, the airline has already unveiled plans to use the A330 300 on flights from Brisbane through to Los Angeles in the future when they resume their network. Over at Qantas Link, there's a host of aircraft from Fokkers to the Dash 8s to the Boeing 717s and even the Airbus A320s. You get where I'm headed with that sort of thing. From taking a look at this fleet list, you'll notice I did not make mention of the MAX or even that of the NEO. This is because the carrier has not made a firm plans to replace their existing aircraft with the latest generation for regional and also that of domestic. However, the airline is currently assessing that of the Embraer E2 and Airbus A220 for regional operations. One of these aircraft types would be drafted to replace its aging fleet of Boeing 717s and of course the Fokker 100s which account for almost 40 of Qantas Link's total aircraft. For primary operations at Qantas in a narrowbody sense, discussions have been ongoing since 2018 for a new plane, but no order has been placed. Currently, both the 737 MAX and that of the A320neo are up for selection in a deal that could be huge for both aircraft manufacturers, as Qantas looks to order 100 total units in the coming years. In your opinion though, I'd like to hear what you believe is best. So what aircraft do you think would best suit the operations over at Qantas for the future? Now this can be for both regional and also domestic, as my focus for this video really encompasses both of these markets. Is it Embraer for one of them? Or is it Boeing and Airbus's orders to lose? You can let me know down in the comment section below. And as always, thank you very, very much for tuning in. Your support is greatly appreciated. I hope you have been enjoying the content and I'll see you in the next one. Take care and please be safe. Oh,